this. It clicked on the weekend, didn't it? It did. It did. Um, it's certainly something we've been focusing on and everything like that. So it was good to see it come to hand. Um, I think it was just a mix of um, going out there and enjoying our footy and also getting our structures right and getting our game plan right and just bringing that, I guess, Lions um, pressure to the game and that really helped us win the first quarter. Was there any um, like soul searching or anything from the previous couple of weeks because they were losses that you guys probably hadn't experienced in the first couple of seasons? Yeah, I think there was a little bit. I think it was more that we just wanted to, I guess, redeem ourselves and things like that. Um, I guess, yeah, we haven't had two losses like that before and it was something that we focused on through the week just to get better and bring out a good performance, I guess. That win goes a long way for confidence. How's the mood in the camp after that? Yeah, look, it was really good last night. Everyone was up and about and enjoying their footy and stuff like that. So um, it's good to see the girls, um, I guess, enjoying their footy again and, um, you know, just getting ready for this weekend. This week, I was going to say this weekend you could I haven't had a look to be honest. Um, I know that we're in a good position now after that win, um, but you know Geelong are the next best side I believe in our conference, so they're going to come in strong and obviously we've got to put on another good performance. You've, you've at least got it into a stage where it's in your own hands, like your destiny is back in your own hands after the weekend. That must be pleasing after yeah, I think so. I think after the rocky start, to be in the position that we are in right now um, is a good thing. Um, but at the same time, you know, if you don't come out and perform each week, it's not really much point. <laughs> um, oh, I think I'm trying to build on each game, um, bringing different things into the game. My pressure is certainly one that I focus on and it's getting better with each game. So um, just, you know, trying to do what Stake says and, and bring that pressure and, you know, the reward comes and... You know, hopefully I can get a few on the weekend. Find a goal. Yeah, every now and then. Every now and then. <laughs> what does um, seeing Kate McCarthy kick a couple of goals do? She's been quiet, but obviously she adds a different element and with her speed and, and the run and carry. Like, you know, she had the best game on the weekend. Yeah, I think that I, I saw it through the preseason, and Kate was always going to start to really bring back that season one um, football that she had and um, to see her, I guess, boost her confidence and play a really important role for the, the um, team on the weekend was really good and I'm excited to see what she can do on a big ground at Burf and Gary this weekend. And the young girls, like what did that, like three debutantes, I know that generally brings some enthusiasm or how did that affect the team? Um, I think it was really exciting to have three debutantes um, on, the, on the night. Um, obviously our captain's pulled out pretty late and we've had Nat come in and um, we're just really stoked for her to get her opportunity. She's been um, an emergency I think the last three or four weeks so um, for her to get that opportunity and the girls really stepped up and played an amazing game on the weekend I think boosts everyone's um, I guess confidence and want to you know work for each other and, and bring that game for themselves. Um, yeah so obviously the performance is great and it gives you a boost but the fact of who it was against as well does that add an extra <laughs> element? Um, I think it does. Obviously, there's a little bit of a wound still there from last year. Um, but it wasn't actually something that we talked about at all prior to the game. It was just more about getting back to playing our footy and, I guess, enjoying that. And, um, yeah, I guess it came to came to life. What do you know about this weekend's opponent, new club and all? Have you seen much of them? Um, I've seen a little bit of their games personally. I, th I think we'll all be doing our homework on the weekend. Uh, for the weekend because you know we don't really know too much about them they are a new team uh, there's a few familiar faces but at the same time at the same time there's probably not a lot that um we could go off just, just with the um with the, with the young girls yeah. i mean we were just five for the 18 playing on the weekend i mean that could be used as an excuse but it hasn't been has it well, it hasn't, and you know, there's a reason that Craig and the team drafted them. It's because they can play and they are ready to be at this level. And it's amazing to see that, you know, um, for us, it's not that they're a bunch of 18-year-olds. It's that they're getting their first opportunity to play at this level, and they're taking it with both hands. So we don't want to see it as an excuse at all. We want to see it as a reason to keep winning because they're good enough to be here.